today in the livestock market, the cattle was down. There two weeks of lower cash is just pressing futures down somewhat. However, you know, the futures did start a little bit higher before that kind of fizzled out. I mean, uh, we had about a buck and a quarter range. Uh, the low is still 164 and a half, so well inside that $4 channel that we've been watching there. And until we break out of there, I, I think that uh, we can see the market moving sideways. Although sometimes when the market pulls back a little bit, we, we might look at it as an indication that maybe demand seems to be slowing. That being said, it's still kind of like early in the game to say anything like that. The CVAL right now is at 11.4%, so it's still pretty strong. Feeders were down as well. Uh, that March placement was higher than expected. Uh, that might have, you know, put some pressure on the market right now. But we're, um, I think that we're slightly off like Friday's uh, new high. And we had a little bit of profit taking, the market kind of coming down. It seems to be a little bit technical right now. But does that mean that 232 and change is the high and that's the actual resistance number because one day off that doesn't really necessarily mean that the market has made this big reversal but we'll see as we go forward uh, i think that the, we just maybe a little slow start to the new month and today does happen to be a little bit of a holiday in other parts of the world now uh, the lean hogs were just a little bit lower as well that um, profit taking kind of to start the month. Now we've had a little bit of a rally off that bottom and believe me, it's been months and months that, since we've seen a few days in a row higher. So the fact that we sold off uh, $2 seems like a lot generally speaking, but I don't think uh, it, I don't think that it necessarily means that all is completely lost right now. So grilling season is really fa fast approaching. And I think uh, that at some point in time that we might get a little bit uh, of a kick with the market. The CBAL is at 24.1% right now, but keep an eye on the uh, economy. We have the Fed speaking on Wednesday. The, uh, the expectation is they're gonna raise rates. Who knows if they do or they don't, but it could have a little bit of an impact on commodities as a whole and certainly on the livestock market.